Good afternoon and welcome to my channel. My name is Matt and if you are someone who is watching my videos for the first time or if you're someone who is returning, welcome and thank you in advance. In today's video, I wanted to share two tote bags that I purchased from a black owned woman ran business on Instagram by the name of Clutch by B. Her items to me are considered as luxury items and I figured, you know, I love the purses. Why not, you know, show them and give a good solid review on them. Um, if you see me looking down, it's because I'm looking at my notes on my phone. I want to make sure that I covered uh, aspects from the color to the, the structure of the bag, the durability, just how the bag looks inside and out, space and everything. So forgive me in advance. Um, the owner's information, her IG page and everything, I will be sure to leave in the description box below for you to view when you have a chance. Um, I've had these purses, I've had these purses or I believe they're classified as tote bags, but that's one of those pick your word, I guess you would say. Um, but I've had the tote bags for, for honestly, I, I believe I have them for about a year. I have not had the chance to really carry them out or, you know, put them to the test and see that how they hold up. But I feel confident that these bags would hold up very well because of how they are made. Um... The first bag I'm going to show you is that good old classic black. So let me go ahead and pull the bag out, show you how it was packaged, how it was sent to me, the dust bag, and you know, all of that. Give me a quick moment. The bag right here, it came in a all white dust bag that says clutch on the front. Now, when I got these, they came in a rather large box because the bags are the bags are, are quite large, I will say. They did come pretty well packaged inside the dust bag. It is um, cardboard right here and also cardboard on the back. And then I'll show you the inside as soon as we get to that part. I'm going to take this out and also this one and show you this nice and lovely here bag. she is. As you can see, it's a nice, well-rounded bag. It has clutch on the front and the standout print. I think it's called embossed print. And it has the gunmetal studs all along the side. It does not come with a strap. I will put that in advance. It does not come with a strap. It is just top handle carry. But again, here's the bag. Here's the side of it. And here is the back of it. Show you the inside here shortly. The inside of the bag, of course, was stuffed with paper to, you know, I guess aid in making sure that it didn't fold or bend or anything like that. Now, here is the inside of the bag. I don't know how good you can see that, but this bag is pretty, pretty deep. It has one zipper. Which is right, what well, has two zippers? Look like it's a, a large slot for if you have like maybe like a mini iPad or something that you can stick in there. And then you also have the smaller zipper, which is more or less like a um, I guess like your, your little coin pouch where you might want to put some coins or you know, lip gloss if you have it or anything. But yes, this is the classic black. I had to get it in black because I feel like with black, you can never go wrong. You're all you're going to always be able to carry it with something whether you want to dress it up or dress it down this is a bag that i i really do feel will go with pretty much like anything honestly but yes this is the black one let me show you the other bag that i purchased as well now this one i had to get just because the color alone the color alone is something special like you don't really see bags this color often. You know, usually come out with a typical flag and then maybe like another earth tone color or something to that extent. But I have not seen this color on a bag in my in my life. I don't feel I've ever seen this bag in, a, in this color. But here it is. It is a pretty like mauve pink color. And it's the same type of design. It has clutch and embossed print on the front. It has the gunmetal studs along the side. And again, that is the side of the bag, the back of the bag, and the front. And again, the bag does not come with any straps, but it is 
top handle carry and they are both they are both the same exact size both are 100% leather which I love I understand when people say something you know in regards to leather and harming animals I fully understand that but I cannot lie I do I do love the smell of fresh leather both bags did come with their own dust bag like I said that is all white and it just has the clutch has her her logo on the front which now, I thought things was really I wanted nice. to um I touched I wanted to touch on the quality of both they are the quality of both bags are 100% leather they have snaps in the middle I believe or do no I'm sorry 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 there are no snaps in the middle it's just a nice firm structure um the colors the colors that I have are the black bag and the mauve bag the other colors, the only other color I believe she has on her site is the snake print, which it, I'm not even gonna lie, snake print is is lovely. I love, I love the snake print honestly. I love it. I love how the inside of the bag is red. That was the standout ticket with that one. I did not purchase that bag only because I'm not the most <laughs> savvy person when it comes to like clothing, accessories, and things like that. I have. You know, I have items that I like and I stick to what I like. I think if I was to order something like that, I don't feel that I personally would ever carry it. So I didn't want to, I would say waste money, but I personally didn't want to buy the bag. But someone out there may actually love the bag. So I'm not going to lie. That is, it's a, a really nice bag. Like I said, what, what puts it over the top to me is the red inside. Like nice, bright, candy apple red inside. It is, it's beautiful. It's just, it's not for me, honestly. But Nonetheless, it is a nice bag. Something that I will say that I did love about the bag was that when you, um, most of the time bags have like the, the metal studs, whether gold or silver or any other color, they have the metal studs at the bottom that's, you know, considered as the feet. But this bag right here, as you can see, it doesn't have like any type of studs. This is the bottom of the bag, the base of the bag, but then the front part, well, the back, and both the front extend past the base to give you something to to have the bag sit on. So like if you do, God forbid you sit on the floor. Because I'm not sure if you remember in, in my previous video um, on a different purse review, tote bag review, I said do not put your bag on the floor. My mother used to tell me if you want to stay broke or if you um, put your bag on the floor, it means you'll be broke forever or something to that effect. I just always find it funny. But no, do not put your bag on the floor. But if by chance you were, it would... It would not, your, your base of your bag would not actually touch the floor. It would just, it would rest because like I said, your, the back of the bag extends past the base part of it. The structure, it's a firm structure. I do not, I do not see this bag honestly ever losing shape. If this bag was to lose shape, I think it would be because I have put something extremely, extremely large in there, which Honestly, I do not see that happening because the the bag itself is pretty is pretty large. The biggest thing that I probably would put in here is I have a iPad Pro and that is pretty huge, but again, it's still slim nonetheless. So I feel that that would be able to fit in here along with just regular accessories like you know your woman's accessories, some lip gloss, things of that nature. I don't I don't see myself stuffing this bag to capacity because. To me, it's just not that kind of bag. If I have that much stuff to wear, I'm like lugging stuff around, I'm going to get me one of the flimsy cloth bags. But this right here, I feel like it's something that, you know, you have a business meeting or anything of that nature. This is where this baby would come into play. Or just in general, just if you're going out for a night on the town or something like that, this is where this will come into play. But I, like I said, I would not by no means overstuff this with like everyday items that if needed, I would just throw into like a, you know, your little flimsy cloth bags or whatever, but not in my actual tote bag right here. A couple other, um, another item that I wanted to point out that I noticed that she did have on her site are sunglasses and eyeglasses. I personally, they're nice, don't get me wrong, they're very nice, they're very pretty, I love that they're oversized, but again, that's not something that I would buy more of like the first person which i do love so but just in case you need to check her out or you needed another reason to check her out by all means she doesn't only just have bags but she has um i want to say i believe she has shoes she has the sunglasses and she has regular eyeglasses as well that are prescription ready if i'm not mistaken but other than that 
that is my review on these. Again, I'm gonna show you both. This is the black bag right here. That's the side and that's the back. And again, it is top carry. There are no straps with either bag. That's that one and here is the mauve bag. It's the front. side and back I'm getting it this top handle I hope that you enjoyed my review of the bags I'm not gonna lie like I said I, I love them I love the way they smell I love the firm structure of them I love I just I love it all the way around this is something that I can see myself having for years honestly down the road which is why which is why I purchased them it isn't it's some items that I don't necessarily buy just because it's just not my thing but some things when I can look at them and tell that number one it's of good quality and number two that it's something I will have for years to come then yes I will go ahead and spend it so like I said I believe I've had these back honestly for about a year now I just I haven't I haven't taken them out anywhere I haven't had a reason to pull this bag out to me this is a special bag this is not just the oh, I'm just gonna you know carry this all through different stores and dug it out like that but no but this is this is a special bag to me so if I pull this bag out it's because I'm, I'm going somewhere and I want this to be my accessory that just kind of like oh look at her she you know she did that or whatever but again these are great bags that I see myself having for for years to come again her information will be down in the description below her name is Brittany but her her business name is Clutch by B and Check her out when you have a moment. I hope that you enjoyed this video and I hope that you return for the next one. Thank you. Bye.